Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be this makeup tutorial right here. It's kind of like this foresty, smoky green kind of-ish. I'm not sure um, how to describe it, but um, I think it's really pretty uh, and folly kind of. It's a little bit different from the fall tutorials I've been doing thus far, so I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you did, please give me a like and subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Hey guys, alright, so we're going to get started by priming our eyes with the Lorac Eyeshadow Primer. This is just the one I got in the uh, Lorac palettes. And then I'm using Painterly Paint Pop by MAC as a cream base. And then I'm going in with the Naked 2 palette by Urban Decay, and we're using Frisk with a MAC 217 brush. And I'm throwing this in the crease. This is going to act as our transition color, blending color, dimension creator, whatnot. And then we're going in with cover. This is a little bit deeper. This is just to uh, deepen the crease, so I'm using the same brush and just throwing that right on top of Frisk. And again, this is just going to deepen it, make, add more dimension, etc. Then I'm going in with this Makeup Geek shadow called Envy. It's a really pretty dark, like, enchanted green, I like to think of it. I'm spraying my flat uh, shader brush and I'm putting that on. We're applying this wet because it gives a nice beautiful sheen and shine and it just applies more pigmented. So I'm putting this all over the lid and then I'm blending that out with the crease brush. And then we're going in with this MAC shadow called Print and it's a nice kind of mid-tone gray. And this I'm using with a pencil brush and I'm applying this on the outer corner slash in the crease um, of my eye and so this is just going to deep in up the outer crease and the gray and the green really look really nice together and then I'm blending that out with my crease brush and then blending again with a clean brush this is plaid by ColourPop it's kind of like a grayish greenish blackish color I don't know how to describe it it's really pretty but again I'm just using this to deepen up the crease and then I'm going in with this random color um, CoverGirl shadow. This is just like shimmery grayish black and we're deepening up the crease again with that. So I'm gradually getting darker with the shades and putting in the outer corner of my eye just to gradually deepen it instead of just adding like the dark color right away. This is Bella Enchanted by Milani and I'm just taking my finger and dotting that in the center of my lid just to add a little pop of bright green. So I'm tight lining and water lining with Urban Decay Perversion and then I'm taking the green and the CoverGirl black and I'm mixing that to go under my lash line. Blending everything out with a clean brush and we're using Kat Von D uh, Tattoo Liner to uh, line my upper lash line. And then I'm going in with the e.l.f. contour palette. So I'm taking that dark contour shade and contouring my cheekbones, forehead, and a little under my chin. And then I'm taking that matte yellowish shade and setting it under my eye. Then I'm taking Mary Luminizer by The Balm and we're highlighting with this just on the cheekbones. And then I'm taking Milani Rose Amore Blush. Is that what it's called? Romantic Rose, sorry. Romantic Rose Blush and I'm putting that on my cheeks. This is a matte blush. I love this blush. Then I'm spraying with the Scandinavia Setting Spray, curling my lashes, and applying Benefit Roller Lash Mascara. For lips, I'm using the NYX Lip Primer to prime, and then I'm using the color uh, NYX lipstick and pops and here is the finished look I of course didn't get the lips on camera but here's the finished look so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to check out my latest video here and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one bye Thanksgiving. I'm really excited.